Hey, hey guys, we are back for another video. So let's come on in the room. We got a lot to discuss here. Uh, we're gonna be talking about Jeannie, Ma, and Jeezy's divorce. Um, as you all know, if you don't, Jeezy filed for divorce from Jeannie Ma. This was in September of 2023, and it is still ongoing. So we're gonna jump into the latest updates. Please, please, I don't have any time for any gossip now. Eh? Yes. But before we get into this video, I do need you all to make sure that you are subscribed to the channel and also make sure you have enabled your bell notifications so you do not miss out on a video. Okay, guys, Jeezy and Jeannie Ma's divorce is facing more tension. Um, as the rapper and the TV personality, they continue to battle over their two-year-old daughter um, custody. Now, in a motion filed in Fulton County GA court, this was earlier this week, um, the 46-year-old musician, which is known by the name, his real name is J. Wayne Jenkins, declared that the toddler Monaco would have more stability if he was granted primary physical custody of the child. Jeezy is also afraid that the bond between him and the party's minor child will be diminished because of his lack of parenting time. Now, this is what the motion states. Now, legal representatives for Jeannie Ma did not immediately respond um, to this complaint. Documents review detail new allegations against Jeannie Ma, who is 45 years old, including accusations that she limits the time that Jeezy can spend with their daughter despite an agreed upon schedule. Jeezy also alleges that the talk show host and her relatives or her relatives has served as caretakers for the two-year-old daughter. Um, and it seems that Jeannie Ma removed the daughter from the jur jurisdiction of Georgia. Now, she allegedly took the child on trips to Los Angeles, Vietnam, New York, Dallas, and Boston. And Jeezy is saying he did not know this and was not notified. Now, in February, the former couple reached a temporary agreement that said that Jeezy would have Monaco in his care for a week, and this is once every month. However, Jeezy is stating that when he sent a caretaker to pick up the child for his April parenting time, the caretaker discovered that Jeannie Ma had vacated their California home without notifying Jeezy. Now, Jeezy is stating to date that he does not even know where Jeannie Ma is living with his minor daughter. Now, amongst other things, Jeezy's latest accusation is that Jeannie Ma allegedly lied and she staged a photo of their daughter next to a bag with one of his firearms. Now, Jeezy is saying that Jeannie Ma set this up to make him look unfit. Now, what he's alleging she did is she used this photo in a picture in a December a motion that she filed. And Jeezy's motion clarified um, that Jeezy actually have a license for his firearms and he has always made sure that his firearms were secured and safely away from the child. Now, Jeannie Ma is creating, now this is what Jeezy is saying. He is saying that Jeannie Ma is creating a false narrative as a means to keep the daughter away from Jeezy. Now, Jeezy's motion alleges before adding um, that the rapper, Jeezy has only seen his daughter for seven days since his agreement was put in place. Now, this is basically saying that Jeannie Ma is intentional with trying to not let Jeezy see his own daughter. 
Jeezy also stated when he did see his daughter, she looked lethargic and she appeared to be exhausted and she seemed to be underweight. Y'all, this is bad because Jeezy is saying that Jeannie Ma is seemingly unfit. He is saying that she is intentionally trying to not let him see his daughter. And most also, he's saying that she allows her family to care for the daughter. And he's simply saying he's the dad. These are things that he can obviously do. So in this motion, Jeezy is constantly saying he doesn't know where his daughter lives. He does not know who is caring for his daughter. So Jeezy has requested that the court vacate the agreement that there has been changes in the current circumstances. And he has requested that the court conduct a parental fitness evaluation on Jenny Mile. Woo! So Jeezy is saying that Jenny Ma needs to be checked on and there needs to be some kind of mental health evaluation. Y'all, this is so bad because she's such a beautiful little girl. Um, it's sad that it seems like the mother, according to Jeezy, is probably bitter because he wanted a divorce and is doing everything to keep this baby girl away from her dad. Y'all, this is sad. Now, y'all, this is some very astounding information. And here's the deal. This is Georgia. I know Jeannie Ma is in California, but let me just tell you something about the Georgia judges. They not with taking kids away from their dads. Um, so if what Jeezy is saying is correct and this can be proven, there could be a great possibility that she can lose custody of her daughter. And women, listen, and men do it too. Why do y'all get so bitter? The men too, this is not just for the women, and interfere with the relationship that the child has with a father. Because Jeezy is saying, not only does he not know where she lives, she moved. So why would she move and take the baby somewhere and he doesn't even know where she lives? Like, y'all, this is bad. Um, and I know some of y'all going to be in the comments saying, well, what about his other kids? He doesn't have custody of them. Okay, y'all have to give people, and I am not a Jeezy fan, y'all have to give people the opportunity to make a change. So if he did not have custody of those kids, he's probably realizing that maybe he could have did more. Maybe he should have did more. Um, I'm all for parents actually splitting the custody. Um, but what Jeezy is saying here is that he wants a change and he wants her to be re -eval He wants her to be evaluated because he's noticing some things that's just not adding up. And for the simple fact that he's saying she moved out of her house, didn't tell him where she was going. He had a custody arrangement where he was supposed to have the child for X, Y, Z amount of time. And then all of a sudden that ended and the child is, you know, all, you know, going on all these vacations and he doesn't even know where the baby is. So y'all, this is going to be a problem. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and enable your bell notification so you do not miss out on a video.